It is July 5th, 2019. I am out in front of the building in which West Dallas and West Dallas Police and West Milwaukee Police savagely, brutally, wickedly killed Adam Thomas Trammell in the hallway. I was talking to his brother Derek yesterday and he says on the autopsy report as well, which I didn't know, is that Adam bled to death in the hallway, 15 officers on him bleed from the mouth. We gotta have justice for Adam. I'm commemorating my campaign, no shirts this summer, and remembering Adam Thomas Trammell, my nephew, and any of those of you who go to the site, who know how Adam Tremell was brutally murdered by the police, and who have some real positive ideas on how we can shut down West Milwaukee, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, police departments, 414-628-2333. Again, it is July 7th. We are here at 54 and Greenfield at the building in which Adam Thomas Tremell was savagely and brutally murdered. It ain't over. We need justice for Adam Thomas Tremell. We need justice for his family, for the family. The Rada, he called for, that's my older sister. She's the oldest. Adam's father. We want justice for Adam Thomas Jamel. We want those those police officers in prison. They should be in prison. They should be in prison or they could do the rightful thing and commit suicide or get their, get, get their cells out. All of them. Not some of them, all of them. Again. We need justice for Adam Thomas Tremell, for West Milwaukee's brutal murder of Adam Thomas Tremell. Hallelujah. And they were so proud to continually show Adam's body. I know I have never lived in this area, but if the people are afraid of a man without a shirt, they got some issues in their self. We need Adam, we need justice for Adam Thomas Jamel and for the family. We need those officers convicted and locked up. Tight! <laughs>